After making your gallery, you're going to want to be able to put it into your web page, which I've done here. Looking at it in Safari, I can go ahead and play a slideshow of my web page. I can go forward, backward, basic gallery, and uh, let me show you how I did it. I'm going to close this out, go into Dreamweaver. So to make this gallery appear in Dreamweaver, what we want to do is use an iframe. And an iframe is a little piece of code. If you look over here, um, basically it is as simple as iframe source equals, and then I have a path name to the gallery, and I'm telling it to be 100% wide and 500 pixels high. Okay, and what that does is an iframe creates a little window on our web page that we can stick other external files into. In this case, we're just using this source file of my cactus gallery. And when I go ahead and I view that, it is going to pop in right inside of my HTML code and there we have a gallery working inside of a web page. Once again it's as simple as this this iframe source this is I have this in this middle div tag so um, there's nothing special about that it's just what I'm putting inside of it it's just as if I'm putting an image inside of my uh, div tag but in this case I've got an iframe source equals and what I'll do is stretch that out so you can see the code a little better this is it for an iframe piece of code it's nothing more than that it's an open tag close tag source equals and then you just identify you would have to make sure that you put your gallery into the same folder as the rest of your site is and um, that's all there is to it as far as putting your gallery onto your web page.